hello students we continue with second chapter conceptual design in this lecture we discuss the relationship in a previous lecture we discuss the attributes and the types of the attributes now we discuss the components of er models in which we discuss the relationship a relationship is an associations between the several entities when we say that relation relations means connections among the entities whereas relationship is an association between the several entities a diamond or rhombus is used to represent the relationship for example here employee and the departments these are the two entities but the relationship between the employee and department is shown employee works in a department employee works in a department here work is a relationship and which are represents in a diamond shape the links are given to connect that the two entities and that connections are that links are with the relationships so from employee employee those are works for department means employees and departments are connected by the relationship works so relationships is an uh, connections between the two entities and in er diagram that represented in a diamond shape a relationship set is a collections of all relationship of same type is a relationship set for example the many employees are working for the different departments so it's a relationship set is a work for that is a these are the eight relationship sets there are the different relationship types they are mapping constraints degree of relationships and the participation constraint these are the three types of the relationship type first one is a mapping constraint second one is the degree of relationships and third one is the participation constraints in which mapping constraints are one to one one to many many to one and many to many relationships where in a degree of relationships there are the unary binary and ternary and the participation constraints are total partial that are the types of the relationships in a mapping constraints the how many entities to, are related to the other sides of the entities according to that that mapping constraints are formed so that the one to one one to many many to one and the many to many the degree of relationships that is the how many number of entities are related to each other but they are the unary binary and ternary and the participations how many number of entities are come forms to uh, find the relations according to that they are classified into the total partial participation and the partial participation now we discuss the mapping constraints the ma mapping constraints are the number of entities from each side participating in a relationship set the cardinality refers to the maximum number of times an instance in one entity can release the instance to the another entity there are the four types of the mapping constraints first one is a one to one one to many many to one and the many to many that that mapping constraints are the number of entities from each side those are participating in a relation but there are the four types one to one one to many many to one and many to many this mapping constraints we discuss in very details with the example the first type is a one to one in a one to one relationships when at most one instance of an entity a is associated with one instance of an 
entity b in this example a is a entity and b is a another entity so the association between these two entities a1 which are directly connected to the instance of in entity b a2 which is directly connected to the instance of the b2 from the entity b and a3 which are directly connected to the instance of uh, b3 in an entity b so these are the direct connections between the direct and only one connections between the two entities so that types of the mapping cardinalities are the one to one for example one person has a one passport each employee has their own office and each office is only occupied by one employee means in one office uh, each employee one employee works in a one office he is not working in a many office he works in a one office then one family lives in a one house and that house contains only one family so this is the one to one relationship that is the one is one entity which is associated with the another one entity they are not associated with the different many entity so that types of the relationships are one to one for in that uh, represents in a er model as for one person has a one passport one family stay in a one house so that types of the relationships is a one to one relationships in one to many relationships when one instance of entity a is associated with the many number of instance entities in b an entity in b is associated with at most one entity in a in the above example entity a and entity b are given in entities a a1 is the instance which are connected to the b1 and b2 also a2 which has the relations b3 and b4 and a3 which has the relations to the only the b3 so that types of the that types of the instances that b1 and b2 which are only connected to the a1 b3 and b4 which are connected only the a2 such types of the relationship one entity which are related to the many sides of the relationships so that types of the relation is a one to many here one side of the relationships is called parent and many side of the relationships is called the child for example one customer gives the many order then one student takes the many subject in one department was the many employees that are the examples of the one to many which are represented in a er model as one customer gives the many order one in a one department works the many employees these are the examples of the one to many relationships then third one is the many to one relationships in a many to one relationship when for one instance of entity in a is associated with the many number of instance entities in b and b is associated with at most one entity in a that is many to one relationship which is exactly opposite to one to many relationship for example many politicians works for a one party many employees works for a one department so these are, are represented in a er model chart many politicians presents in a one party many employees works in a one department then last is a many to many relationships in a many to many relationship when for many instance of entity in a is associated with many number of instance in entities in b and 
entity is be associated with any number of instances in a entity a so that types of the relationships are the many to many relationships in the many to for example many traveler travels from many buses many authors writes the many books such types of the examples are the many to many relationships this about represented in a year model many traveler travels in a many buses many authors writes the many books these are the examples of the many to many relationships thank you